Welcome back to Near Beer Barbecue Baseball. That's right, I am back with another non-alcoholic beer from Hairless Dog. Had a couple of their other ones in past videos, uh, but we're gonna give the non-alcoholic Citra Lager a try today. It is 70 calories, 0% alcohol, and uh, it does say it has 50 IBUs. So that is the International Bittering Units. And uh, 50 is pretty high, uh, especially for a non-alcoholic beer. So what that tells me is they used a lot of hops on this. So I'm looking forward to trying it like I am all the other ones. So let's get it into a glass. Let me show you the, the can here real quick before I go too quickly and again it does you can see here it it claims right there zero percent alcohol so you know again some of them have 0.3 some of them have 0 0.03 you know this this claiming it has 0.0 percent so no alcohol whatsoever into the glass Look at there. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Oh my gosh. Yes, this looks like they used, uh, it's called Citra Lager. So I'm wondering if they used quite a bit of lemon peels or something on this thing. Wow. It is very citrusy. I mean, knock your socks off citrusy. It smells really damn good. I mean, look at the sediment floating in that thing. I'm, I'm, hold, I'm not even holding it on camera. I'm over here going, look at this. Golly, that's a lot. That is a lot. Enjoy by August 3rd, 2021. So we are, I'm gonna give this the old swirl. Dump the rest in there. Let's see what else we get. Hmm, man, it got worse. Wow. That is amazing, but enough about the sediment already. It's a good looking beer. It is, uh, it does have a very nice uh, dark golden color. Um, again, it's, it's hazy. You can, you can't, you can see the shadow of my fingers, but you can't see through it, but it is a very good looking beer. So hats off to you, hairless dog. And the smell is, again, citrus. It's, it's got some lemon characteristics to it for sure. So, cheers to you all. Wow. <laughs> yes, indeed. This is super hoppy. I'm gonna be honest with you. It's got a lot of tea qualities to it. I want to say one of their other ones that I had had some tea qualities. I don't know if that's the hop they're using. I get some sweetness on my lips, like a lemon. It doesn't taste like a lager. It says it's a lager, but that's just a brewing process. But, you know, compare it to your typical lagers that you've known, been known to drink before, and you're not going to get this. You're not going to get that with this.
it tastes like a lemon tea. It's not bad. I like lemon tea. Does it taste like a, a non-alcoholic beer? Yes, maybe. Not not completely. It um, if I was sitting somewhere and there's someone threw this in front of me and said, "Hey, try this beer out for me," and I drank it. I wouldn't know it was non-alcoholic, but I would know there's something different about it. Let's just put it to you that way. And it's not bad. It's just, it, it tastes a lot like lemon tea to me, which isn't bad. I like that. But it's pretty dry. I mean, my tongue is really, really dry. Um, so if you like hoppy, lemony, citrusy type of drinks, this... You would like this, I would think. Um, it's not bad. For non-alcoholic beer, I would give this a 3.75. Would I drink this all the time? No, and I'll tell you why. Is because all the acid that's in here from the lemon would just destroy my stomach. And, uh, you know, I, I don't hate myself that much to do that. So, um, 3.75 from Beer Barbecue. I'm sorry. 3.75 from Near Beer Barbecue Baseball. And uh, if you've had this, let me know what you thought. I'm, I'm very interested. Um, if you haven't and you're into non-alcoholic beers, run out and try this. Um, let me see where they're out of. They're out of Minneapolis, Minnesota. So I, know, I don't know where their distribution is, but we get all kinds of these now. So um, cheers to all the non-alcoholic beer drinkers out there. Uh, good luck to you in your adventure and finding good beers uh, that you can drink without alcohol on it. So here's to you all, and thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.